Mr. DeWitt. Are you all right? I'm fine. You were dreaming. You kept saying your daughter's name, Sally. She's not my daughter. I thought... Pain and beauty. To an artist, they are parent and child. Cohen? I'm sending you to find your young one. <laughs> no need to thank me. I'm not so sure you'll like what you find. Look. Fontaine's. Ryan sent the whole thing to the bottom. But it's a prison now. Why would Cohen have sent Sally there? I don't know. Everyone has needs. I merely provide a service for those who have the means to pay. You'll find your little bird in the housewares department. How many people do you suppose Ryan's got locked up in that place? Enough. Fontaine had amassed something near an army. Now they're down there, spliced up and wild. All right, there's a dock up ahead. Takes a cold son of a bitch to do that to a living person. No, what's that? Barry, let's see. You read your residency contract with Ryan Industries? In perpetuity, we're all buried at sea. Comfortable. Keep your eyes open. Seem to be some supplies this way, Mr. DeWitt. It's Booker. What? Just call me Booker. If it's all the same to you. Let's leave it at Mr. DeWitt. Let's have another look around. Perhaps we'll be able to find something to get us up and over. Could be. A skyhook? Skyhook? You mean the air grabber? Kids use them to ride around up on the pneumo lines. Air grabber? Constants and variables. Constants and what? Never mind. Goddamn grabber stuck. I want the frost one. Get me frost. Mr. DeWitt! Someone's coming! Alright, I got the grabber unjammed. You and me talk! Mr. DeWitt, look. Housewares. That's where Cohen said we'd find Sally. The store ran trams between the three buildings. We'll need to avail ourselves of that. Assuming it still works. Optimism, Mr. DeWitt. It helps in situations like this. When did you come to Rapture? Oh, it was, uh... Jeez, I guess around... 51? No. 48? That's a rather large gap. Time. Life I had before. Sort of becomes a blur. 49. 
49 for sure. Damn. You look a mess, Mr. DeWitt. Just keep your eyes open for splicers. They can do us a whole lot worse. Eat it up. Well, it, it's good for you, you know? I've never heard of birds that didn't like seeds. What's, what's the matter with you? Do you think it's poison? That splicer had no problem freezing a path for himself before. I'm sure he'll be happy to do the same for us. I have no doubt you'll prove persuasive. Mr. DeWitt, look. An ice rink. Be good at places any to look for our new friend. It says it's on the top floor. So we go up. 